Let me get last week's notes. Yeah, sure. You didn't come to class that day. I couldn't come. Why not? I wasn't feeling well. Here they are. Thanks a lot. Are these all the notes? Oh, no. This is the rest. Thank you very much. It's no problem at all. What is the best place to park? What vehicle do you usually bring to school? Is it an automobile or, or a motorbike? I drive a motorcycle. Okay. That means you can park in the student lot or on the street. Have you seen the handicapped spots? I'm not sure what a handicapped spot is. Look for the blue signs and blue marked spaces. Do you usually park in the daytime or the evening? I park days and evenings. And be careful about the time limits on the streets. Have you seen the signs for time limits? What signs? As long as you are careful reading the signs, you will always know how long you can park and what days are okay to park there. Are you aware of the curb colors? What curb colors? If you can remember that red means absolutely no parking and white means that you can only load and unload, you're going to be okay. Can you help me buy my textbooks? There will probably be a book list in the bookstore. Do you have your class schedule handy? No, I don't have that. To get started, take that list over to the bookstore. Do you know where the bookstore is? I am not sure where the bookstore is. When you pass the gym, it'll be the first door on your left. Do you know how to sell your old textbooks for money? Yes, I knew I could do that. Exactly how do I go about selling them? If you give your used textbooks to the person at the booth outside the door, he will reimburse you. Can you go over there today? I think maybe I could be there. I am free at one today or tomorrow if you need some help. Want to meet me over there? Maybe that would work. I'll catch you later on. Have a wonderful morning. Would you talk to me about taking one of Dr. Miller's classes? Yes. Have you ever been in one of his classes? I'm thinking about taking his class next semester. He was a very easy teacher. Are you thinking of taking a class with him? I'm not sure, because I really need to learn something. But I also worry about grades. Grades are important. But don't you think that gaining the knowledge is important, too? I really need to learn this stuff. He made everything so interesting that the time just flew by. Do you know what I mean? Yes. That sounds right for me. Did you know that he came here last year after 10 years in the military? Yeah, I already knew that. That could be a good thing. I think you know that you have to make the best decision for you. Enjoy your year. I don't know how to fight a parking ticket. Did you get written up for exceeding the time limit or for parking where you weren't supposed to be? Both. Did you see all the signs and just decide to blow them off? I was confused. Maybe you could explain that you are new and got confused. Could you do that? If it might work, I'll go for it. Let the judge see that you are only a poor, starving student who won't do it again. I can see how that might work. Without actually saying that the parking ticket guy was an idiot, make it seem as though it was his mistake, not yours. I could do that. Try it. It just might save your price of a parking ticket. Could we go over some things because I think my test score is wrong. What do you think is wrong? The math or the way you answered was scored? Both. I am willing to take a second look because teachers make mistakes too. Will that work for you? Yeah, I'm ready. Check your answers against the ones on the answer sheet. And let me know where you see the mistake. These look strange. Yes, I agree. Let's move on to calculating of the score. Would that be okay? Okay, let's do the calculation. We add all of these up and divide by this, and that gives us the, this percentage. I see. Anytime you have a question, please feel free to ask. What date will our field trip be on? The science field trip is next Monday at 8 o'clock in the morning. Do you want to make a note of that on your calendar? Yes, I will make a note of that. Next Monday is December 2nd. 
The buses will leave at 8, but we must begin loading at 7.30. I'll be there half an hour early. You might want to tell whoever is picking you up that you will return on December 8th. Do you have a ride? Yes, someone is picking me up. To get back to campus by 8 p.m., we will be leaving the campsite at 5 p.m. Do you have any more questions? Not at the moment. Maybe later, though. All of the extra information that you need is on the bulletin board in the hallway. See you on Monday. How do you decide what grade we get? I look at many things, attendance, quizzes, and tests. What is the most important factor? Obviously, I look for improvement as we go along, but I would like you to do your best from the beginning. How can we keep track of our grades? The final and midterm are 40% of your grade. Homework, attendance, and quizzes total 60%. What if we can't get to school? You can only miss one class without penalty. If we have a major problem, will you let us know? I will be letting you know during the year if you have a major problem. I'm not sure how to add a class. Do you have an ad sheet for me to sign? I'll bring one next time. When you get the signed ad slip, you must take it to the admissions and records office or you will not be added. Can you find the office? I think I know where it is. Across the courtyard on the right is the office. Follow the signs to the correct line. Is that clear? Thank you for your directions. It's clear. You can't miss it. Add the class and then come back. We'll check later to make sure you are on the roll sheet. That's great. Thank you so much. Do the same thing with a drop slip if you ever need to drop a class. Good luck. My library books are late. Where can I put them? This is where they need to be turned in. Let me see them to check the date, okay? Yeah. I think that they are really late. Not all that late. You only owe the library 50 cents. What if I can't pay it? We appreciate you paying off all fines as soon as possible, but always before the end of the semester. Yeah, I get it. Your report card and transcripts will be held until you pay all fines, so always make sure that you do that. That's not really fair. If we aren't here, always feel free to use the night drop outside. Thanks for coming in. Let me tell you what happened to my homework. Okay, go ahead. What is the, the excuse this time? Actually, I did it, but then it got lost. Could you have gotten it done at another time? Yes, I could. You have never missed an assignment before. When will you be making this one up? I'll make it up early next week. That would work, but don't let it happen again. I'll try. That will solve it then. Let's work hard to not let it happen again. I want to know how to buy something from this machine. Yeah, the new ones can be tricky. What are you trying to buy? I want to buy one of those snack things. Are you ready to go? I'm clear so far. The money goes in the slot over there. It has to be smooth to go in. It won't go in. Just remember that you might have to feed the money in a couple of times to get it to work. Yes, next step? Make your selection and hope for the best. Vending machines aren't all that reliable. They're totally unreliable. You seem to have it down. Have a good day. Professor, I'm concerned about my grades. Do you have a minute? Of course. How can I help you? I want to know if I am doing okay. Let's pull out your score so far. Do you think you are doing okay? I am afraid that I might not be doing all that well. I'm seeing that you are doing okay in some areas, but not so well in others. I think I could take better notes and read a little more. You can greatly improve your grades by always reflecting on what you can improve on. I'm working on it. Just do your best, and I am sure that you will see improvement. This parking meter is really confusing. Can you help me figure it out? It's just like the old one, but with new stuff added. Yeah, okay. The first step is deciding on debit or credit card payment. So which one is it? I have coins. Perfect. Now, can you see the rate on the sign? I didn't see that, but now I do. 
Once you know what it will cost, put the payment in. Here it goes. You are doing great. Let me move on to the next step. I am a little confused. Just make sure that everything registered, and then you are good to go. I have to miss school next week. Isn't there some way you could work your schedule out to be here? Unfortunately, that is what I have to do. How are you going to catch up? I've got it all covered. If you miss this class, you will have used up your quota for the semester. Don't worry, this will be the last class I miss. Make sure to remind me right before you are absent. I'll remember. Enjoy your day off and don't forget to study. I was supposed to meet with you at one thirty. Yes, I see. What did you need to see me about? There's a problem with my schedule. What's the problem? Two of my classes occur at the same time. Well, I can see that's a problem. Is it at all possible for you to fix that error? Yes, I can. Would you still like to have both of these classes? I want to keep both of them if that's possible. Well, let me find you one of these classes on a different day. Thanks a lot. I am sorry, but I can't stay until the end of class. Where do you need to be? That is more important than school. I have an appointment. Do you have a plan to make up your missed work? No, but I'll make sure someone helps me out this week with my missed work. Are you going to go right away? I am leaving right now. All right, but please remember that it is your responsibility to catch up. Thanks, Professor. I'll make sure everything gets taken care of. Goodbye, and try not to miss any more school. Good morning. Is this where I can get a library card issued to me? Yes, no problem. We have a short form right here. Just hand it to me when you are done. I'm done. That looks great, but I will also need your driver's license or other form of ID. Sure. Here it is. Well, this looks nice. Do you know how to use it? I am pretty sure how to use it, but can you remind me? Of course. Just remember that all of the needed information is on the card. I see. Well, I hope you have a wonderful time on your library visits. Could you help me to register for a class? Do you know what class you want to take? Are there any psych classes available? I believe there are still two psychology classes open. On what days are the classes? There is one class on Tuesday and Thursday from two to four. Can you tell me about the other class? It's from ten to twelve on Monday and Wednesday. You're positive that these are the only classes left. These two are the only ones. The class on Monday and Wednesday will be fine. Very good. Do you mind helping me? What can I help you with? I'm not sure how to find my next class. Do you know what building that's in? The C building, I think. Well, that's not far away. Could you point me in that direction? Do you know what the room number is? It's C two six one. My next class is around there. Can you show it to me? Sure, let's go. How is everything going with you? Great. You? Pretty good. Good for you. When did you start going to PCC? This is my second year. How about you? I only got here this year. You like it so far? It's okay. I can tell you don't really like it. It'll get better after I finish my general education. I understand what you mean. I want to buy a parking permit, please. Are you a full-time student, or do you attend part-time in the evenings? I attend both day and evening classes. Will you be riding a motorcycle, or do you drive a car? I ride a motorcycle. That permit will run twenty-five dollars. Will that be cash or credit card? I'll use a credit card, thank you. Do you need a second permit for your car? No, just the motorcycle permit. Fine, here it is, and have a great semester. Professor, do you have a few moments when I could meet with you? I scheduled my appointments from two to four on Saturday. What works best for you? Three would be a good time. Great. Do you need directions to my office? I'm not sure. Well, just make sure to go through the double doors, and I'll be on the right. Okay, I'll find it. It's very easy to find. See you then.
I will enjoy seeing you. Have a good week. Let's have some lunch. Do you know of a great restaurant somewhere? Yes, I'm hungry. What types of food sound good? Maybe just a quick sandwich, salad, or something. I have a great idea of where you might like to go. Can we walk there? It's on the second floor. May I join you? Of course. Let's go. Let's hurry. I'm starving.